the whip it epidemic. Hey, twin. What's the word, twin? Let me get a whip it, twin. <laughs> Nigga, what the fuck is a whip it? I never thought helium will be a trendy drug. How the fuck y'all make crash shells look better? I'm built like... Who the fuck is that? I want... What the hell? 11 o'clock. I want to enslave white rappers. 5.45. The Whip It Epidemic. 8.30. Sport betting sucks. 12.45. Cowboy Bebop. This a real nigga. Uh, not the first one. Not the first one, though. Not the first one, but, like, you know, the rest of the three is cool. <gasps> It seems that these young niggas picked up a new drug and it's called fucking whippets. Nitrogen fucking oxide. Fucking ridiculous. What's your name? Where you from? <laughs> <laughs> I'm from the whip. You're down the street, man. Come on, man. Down the street, man. Did you just say? He got so much helium up his ass, I couldn't even hear not one word. His voice is so fucking deep, he sound like. This nigga really just came back. I ain't gonna lie, B. Good time, bro. Playboy Cardi. I'm not gonna lie to you. The like, most bro, I've seen this drug fuck, is in bro? the city of Atlanta. Listen, listen to these voices. Go ahead. What the fuck? What the fuck? Bro, what the fuck is it? Bro, so is niggas getting high off that shit, or is that shit just like, like what it, like it's just helium? Now I'm not gonna lie to you. If I see a bunch of these niggas with a bunch of switches and gem fives, I'm running like no neck Jake. And I've seen a lot of people be peer pressure to try this drug, cause it's really not a drug. It shouldn't be a drug. It's twisted. Twisted this way. You're gonna be offended if I rub yeah. this off? Nah, for sure. I do every time when somebody else I did it. I twist it and then yeah. you suck? Like this. No, no, whoa. Did no diddy. No diddy, no diddy, no diddy. No diddy. No diddy. Uh -oh. Don't do no sucking, uh -oh. bro. That was that. Right. That was that. Right. Twist it more. Adam, you know what the fuck that shit is, bro. You did it like you know what you did. He know what it is. You're... I only ever done it out the balloon or the, uh, or the little cartridge uh, thing. I never, I never did it like. Yeah. See, my so niggas is just sucking helium, bro. Niggas dead ass just get addicted to doing fucking anything. Voice turning all crazy like you. I sound yeah, like Cardi. Yeah. What's uh, going on? I'm gonna start the opium with this voice. <laughs> Well, I'm not gonna lie, Adam 22 getting peer pressure makes sense because he's a fucking loser. That's why his bitch got fucked in front of thousands of fans, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> By Lil D. You get what I'm saying? So it's understandable that his ass will get peer pressure. I can see him doing that. Now, Whippets has always been a trend since 2016. I think the first rapper I've ever seen take Whippets is TJX6 when he started to fall off. Now, after <laughs> I saw TJX6 do it, I see a lot of other rappers doing it as well now. Now it's become a trend. Hey, is this nigga playing Ninja Gaiden? Now I see Gunna and Young Thug doing it as well. What the fuck? <laughs> then I see Lil Uzi. Now I see, which probably makes the most sense now, Kanye West doing this shit as well. Frank Garcia, this is Jay, I'm on the nitrous. The whip it. That nigga said I'm on so the nitrous. Right Niggas are now what putting it in their songs. Fuck your hoe off the back from the bro. No, no, replay that shit, nigga. The from the back out the Fuck the hoe from the back off the whip it. I'm not gonna lie, gang. If I walk in on my bitch fucking a nigga and that nigga is hidden a whip it as he fucking my bitch, nigga, everybody in that household gonna have to die. I don't give a fuck who in that bitch, nigga. That bitch is getting ARP'd out, nigga. I don't care, nigga. That bitch getting the fucking airstrike dropped. I, I swear to God, I don't care. I ain't gonna lie, twin kinda hard. I'm gonna be for real. And where you niggas gonna find Bro, that nigga just mentioned a whipping like five times. These niggas the most at is that lost in the sauce place. I don't know what it is. 
But they love them little burgers and wings and them little fries. They come in with the ski mask. You're going to see a bunch of them, and they're going to have that fat-ass galaxy gas right on the hill. Tell you, you that bitch from? galaxy gas. You're tossing it off. No doubt. Yeah. No doubt. No doubt. Yeah. If I catch a bitch, I'm getting her number. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. In the summer. Yeah. What else? What's the drink? Yeah. Get low. Let's get low. Yeah. Hey, y'all want everything. Give me some ketchup on that. Come over there, bitch. No, what the fuck? Shit, I don't know this one ain't get long. I ain't like, that shit kind of look good, though. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. How that be him, gang? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nigga! Bro, this nigga hitting that bitch as he eating. What the fuck is going on? What am I watching, bro? The man said, I'm good. I don't need no bath. I got the whipping. That's crazy <laughs> as fuck. And look at them old heads. Them sca they scared as fuck at them young niggas. Look at them. They terrified. They don't want no. You say old head, nigga. That don't even look like no fucking old head. The nigga on the left, dude. Business with them niggas. Bro, even the young nigga right beside him is terrified and disappointed. Like, this nigga looks disgusted. Like, really? In public, nigga? In public? As I'm growing up. Bro, them young life, niggas don't get no fuck. Right. Maybe weed can be a gateway drug. I personally never seen anybody go full on junkie when they touch weed, but maybe it should be a gateway drug. I have that shit crazy. I feel like that shit just gotta be in you though. I really don't think weed got anything to do with it. I dead ass don't. It just be like some niggas will smoke weed and that's it. They will not do shit else like me. Then some niggas smoke weed and be like, nah, I need some more shit. That's where the junkie shit come in, bro. That shit don't got nothing to do with, with weed itself, bro. That shit really do just depend on what type of nigga is doing the weed. Maybe it should be considered a gateway junk for real. And look, I'm not giving them young niggas excuse. They can do what they do. They know what's right from wrong. They know not to put nitrous oxide in their fucking body. As a person who smokes weed, all I'm just saying is maybe that can be used as consideration because if you took a whip it, you most likely smoked weed before. And I'm not gonna lie, maybe I'm tripping. But as a society, I'm seeing a lot of these young niggas now are just finding new ways to get high because their dopamine receptors are fried. It's kind of <laughs> like they're running out of ideas to get high. And it seems like they're just going to the most craziest shit that can go past their tolerance. And I'm not gonna lie, our society is cooked because in a couple of years, you niggas are going to die. And I don't think these young <laughs> niggas really know how much Man, this nigga is funny, bro. <laughs> nigga said all the young niggas gonna die because of this shit. <laughs> now, nah, them niggas is gonna die, though. Nigga, why are you hitting fucking whippets, bro? Why are you hitting fucking nitrogen oxide, nigga? What the fuck are you doing? Nitrous oxides can do to your body. The symptoms it can really do to your body. It says it has nerve damage. It can put you in a coma. You can die. Bro, this is literally brain rot. And the other thing about the whippets is that the whippets cost so much. I think they go around for like $100, $160. Nigga, what? I look up whippet. Nigga, whippet is a fucking dog? This ugly ass dog. <laughs> nigga. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga ugly. Ugh, why a neck so long? What the fuck? Nitrous oxide cuts off oxygen to the brain, creating a euphoric high that lowers your mental and physical pain. Also, that shit do get you high. Bro, still though, you taking in nitrous oxide. That shit don't even sound like no shit you supposed to even be near. Bro, that's an expensive ass drug. To be real, I don't even think we cost that much. You can no, get you a don't. nice little it three don't. five for like 30 to 40 dollars, man. Maybe 60 if it's real good za. And then if you can get you an ounce, an ounce is like what, 80, sometimes a hundred? You get what I'm saying? So it's like, bro, you don't even have to do all that much to get hot. And like I said before, yes, I'm not giving the young niggas an excuse, but we gotta be real here and look at the bigger picture. Why is nitrous oxide so accessible to the general public? And look, I know this is used for whipped cream, and I know a lot of people just use this for whipped cream. There is this Wait, what? percentage of people that are using this for fucking drugs. 
Nigga, that shit is used for whipped cream? What the fuck? And the government definitely knows about whippets and the little epidemic it has right now. And that's why New York just passed their law that you have to be over 21 to purchase nitrous oxide. And if you ask me personally, I think it should be over 25 if you can purchase nitrous oxide. Because if you're 21, you're most likely doing it at 20 and 19. And plus, you're gonna probably going to ask somebody. And if you're 21, you're most likely going to still do dumb ass shit. You're still young. So I think over 25 should be the legal limit. Hey, yeah. Personally, that's just me though. I don't know, maybe I'm tripping. I may be tripping, but I ain't gonna lie. That shit look fun as fuck sometimes. So maybe I gotta take a little bit of the galaxy gas and make my voice. Oh shit. Oh no, oh no, oh here, yeah, tweaking. Sound like back one card, I'm gonna Maybe I need to slide the cake, that shit. I might need to do that. I ain't gonna lie, that shit sound fun. Nah, I'm not taking that shit. But I hope y'all like, share, and subscribe, and tune in for the new video. Them young niggas cook.